How to get your emails delivered to your subscribers' inboxes. Just because you have a large mailing list, that doesn't necessarily mean that you're going to succeed at email marketing. In fact, this is really just the first step to running a successful marketing campaign, and not necessarily the most difficult step at that. The hard part, then, is actually getting your subscribers to read your messages. And this, in turn, is not only a matter of writing persuasive messages that people want to open, but also boils down to getting your messages to actually reach your subscribers' inboxes. This means bypassing their spam filter, and it means avoiding their social and promotional mailboxes, too. In this presentation, we'll look at a couple of things that you can do to help ensure your messages end up in the right place. Write by hand. The first and most important step by far is to make sure that all your messages are handwritten. That doesn't mean you need to get out the quill. It means that you need to stop using auto-generated subject headings and greetings, and instead write each message personally. Avoid spam terms. Spam filters are based on algorithms, which means that they can only do so much. One way that spam filters work is by looking for specific terms that will be considered warning signs that a message is not handwritten. Examples include words like Viagra, handbags, money, cash, etc. Avoid these terms and you'll reduce your likelihood of getting filtered. Keep your messages short. Think about the last message you got from a friend. How long was it? Chances are that it was probably a few hundred words at most, and not thousands of lines long. Keep this in mind. Avoid images. Likewise, avoid large images and attachments. Gmail and other email clients can't scan these, and so they are extra cautious. Ask to be whitelisted. The best strategy for getting into customers' inboxes, and one of the ones that is most often overlooked, is simply to ask your visitors to whitelist your messages. If you keep on providing value, and your customers have come to value the content you provide, then you should find that they respond positively if you ask them to consider telling Google that your messages belong in the inbox. All this can really help your messages to end up in the inbox, but remember, the secret to success is to focus on the human element and forget the bots. That's what the bots want you to do anyway. For more free educational content, visit learnforfree.biz. Content produced and distributed by AllSuperInfo.